hi guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome and um, today what I am making for dinner is meatloaf I did already throw everything in and I did um like make it like a I'm pretty sure you guys can see like a loaf of bread so the only reason I didn't show is because it's a it's, it was gonna be a little bit hard for me because I was gonna have to get in there and um, so I'm just gonna tell you what what I used um, I got two of these meatloaf packets McCormick and in the back it does say the ingredients but I'm gonna tell you guys either way and um, so for all this meat right here it was five pounds of ground beef and then I used this bag of the mixed vegetables but I only used half see it's only half waste so I threw that in there and then I threw in a whole bag of the of the breadcrumbs and then um, since it is double the ingredients because I put two of these I put um, I put an extra pound but so it was only supposed to be four pounds but I threw in five pounds because everybody in my house loves meatloaf and then so it was only supposed to be half a cup of milk so what I ended up putting for this here instead of two pounds of beef, ground beef I put five pounds and then instead of two eggs I did double which was four four eggs and then I put instead of half a cup of milk I did one whole cup of milk and for the quarter cup dry breadcrumbs um, I put sorry I'm reading right here I'm just doubling it up for you guys so then I put the whole little bag of the breadcrumbs and um, at the end it says half cup ketchup but I always do a mixture of ketchup and mustard and but that's like maybe like 15 30 minutes before the meatloaf comes out and so since right now I already have it ready to go in the oven um, I'm supposed to put it at 375 degrees so it's already ready to be put in there okay guys so in this little bowl I'm just gonna get mustard and ketchup so here I'm just gonna start putting in the ketchup I just eyeball it it's got to be a little bit more of ketchup than mustard and so then you're just gonna mix it but um, if you like it a little bit sweeter, then put a little bit of more of ketchup. But if you like it a little bit more like sour, like tangier, then you put a little bit more of mustard. It just depends your taste. But I like it a little bit sweeter with the ketchup. So this is how I make it. So now all you have to do is just mix this. So now after two hours, I'm bringing it out so that I can put the mustard and ketchup on top. So I'm just pouring the ketchup and mustard mix that I made and um, if you guys want to make a little bit extra so that when you guys cut it, if you guys are going to eat it on the side and you guys are not going to make like mashed potatoes or gravy, um, you can put some of this on the side because when you do cook it, it's only on the top. So um, it's not on the side. So sometimes um, my husband likes to put a little bit on the side. And so that's just if you guys want to, but you guys don't have to. So I put it all over the, the meatloaf and then I'm going to put it into the oven. I'm going to put it back into the oven for an extra 30 minutes. And so that top is finally done and this is how it looks when it comes out the oven. So I, so I did these biscuits and then I just cut it in half. And so like my husband... My husband and my daughter and my son were going to leave. I just kind of made them like some type of muffin like this with mashed potatoes. And then I cut the meatloaf into like a little small piece like this. And then I just put it on there. And I put a little bit of gravy on top. And then I just put the next bun on top. And then I'll show you when my son is taking a big old bite of that. It's like the McDonald's, the, the breakfast meat. Mm -hmm. 
Chubb's turn. Did you guys hear? He said Chubb's turn. Let me see you eat them. Juice. Can I help you? Here, I help you. Okay. Okay. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Say bye. Bye. Say please like. And please bomb. Say and subscribe. And bye. Say see you next time. In time. Say have a good day. Do <laughs> you want to say it? Say please like. Please like. And subscribe. And subscribe. See you the next time. See you next time. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> bye guys.